Welcome to our scene on the carpal bones. Instead of looking at this poster over here, we're going to look at this 3D model of the hand over here, which I created in order to make the material more fun and memorable. So let's take a look. So let's make a story out of the carpal bones. We have this scared face over here. Scared face for scaphoid. And he's scared because he's looking at the guy on the trapeze. Trapeze for trapezium. I guess the scared face is worried the guy on the trapeze is going to fall. This guy on the trapeze is next to the trapezoid, which is really exciting the captain. Captain for capitate. Now this captain is also really excited because he's standing on top of the moon. Moon for lunate. Since lunate refers to the moon, and this bone kind of resembles that crescent shape, we refer to this as the lunate. The captain is excited about a third thing, this ham over here. Ham for hamate. And we notice the hook of the hamate. Finally, this ham over here is on top of the triangular question mark, which is quite random. Triangular question mark for triquetrum, which is right in back of this pez over here. This is a pez of some form. Pez of some form for pisiform. And if you don't believe me that this is a pez of some form, I brought it to class today to prove it. Here we have our pez container of some form. Pez of some form for pisiform. If you want, you can imagine seeing these images on your own hand in order to make the material more fun and memorable. Alright, I hope you enjoyed this scene on the carpal bones. Take care.